Hey guys, this is Charlie from A Lot of Path RV. This is my first video. Um, I feel a little, a little nervous, um, so try not to laugh at me too hard. Um, normally Sammy does these, but um, we decided to shake it up a little bit and have me do one. Um, in this video, I want to talk about, you know, and it's going to be a short video, I just want to talk about, you know, where I stand on this whole path, on this whole journey that we're going down. Um, you know, God didn't set the same fire in me that he did Sammy. You know, Sammy goes out and he uses, you know, his hands, his knowledge, and his skills, you know, to help those who need that extra help at hand. Um, what God gave me was the spirit of encouragement and support um, for Sammy. You know, so this can, this can all be possible um, for him, for me, and for our family. Um, this has been one of the greatest blessings um, for me, and I know for our family, um, it has been s such a rewarding experience um, just to see how much God is still in control and how much He still moves His children um, to where they need to be. Um, you know, all the volunteers, all the employees who work for Samaritan's Purse and Habitat for Humanity. You know, God placed them there. You know, they're strangers, you know, from all over the U.S. coming to, coming together, you know, usually it's in a different state, you know, and giving their time, you know, to help a, a stranger. You know, they don't know their story, nothing, but God moved them to where they need to be. Um, and, you know, like Samaritan's Purse, you know, at the end of the day, you know, you, you see the crews coming in and everybody filing out of the trucks, you know, after a long, hard day of building a house, you know, and they're strangers and they're getting out after having a hard day, a long day, smiling and laughing, you know, and that's, that's God's movement, you know, that's his love for his children, you know, that's the love that we have, you know, in us because of him. Um, and to see the, the houses and, or the neighborhoods that Habitat for Humanity has done um, for the community, you know, for the people who have lost everything, you know, it's, it's so amazing and it's, and it's, it's beautiful, you know, and it's, it's just a reminder that, you know, that our God is love and, you know, he instills that in us so that we can show the world, you know, just what what we're about, what he's about. Um, you know, and Eli and Jace, you know, giving out the cross-cut pennies, you know. Just to see them so bold already in their faith at such a small age um, is something that... As a parent, you know, it's one of your proudest moments, pretty much, you know, to see your child, you know, tell, tell, go up to somebody and say, you know, Jesus doesn't cost you a penny, you know, it's great, because as an adult, you know, sometimes I don't know if I could be able to do that, you know, even though, you know, I'm following God down a path, you know, that he set before me, you know, sometimes as an adult, you know, we kind of put self first, in, you know, instead of being fearless, you know, we, sometimes we get scared and we get afraid and we, you know, oh, what that person might say to us or, you know, how they might react, you know, and for a six-year-old and a three-year-old to go up you know, and do that, you know, to strangers from South Carolina all the way to New Mexico right now, it has been, it has been so rewarding, you know, and for, so much more for me because I didn't grow up in church, um, you know, I didn't, my family didn't go to church, you know, God really wasn't spoken about, 
um, in my household. Um, so for me to have a child who knows God and who already has a relationship with Him to where He's so strong in His faith already as a child to go up to a complete stranger, you know, and witness to Him. Um, it's, it's amazing, you know, it's, it brings so much happiness for something like that, you know, it's, God moves you where and when He needs to move you, um, and He moved me and Sammy when we needed moving, you know, And it, it's just, you know, I'm kind of lost for words because it has been a journey. It has been a beautiful journey, um, you know, from start to finish, you know, from saying, yes, Lord, I will follow you down this path and taking that first jump, that first leap of faith um, up till now, you know, it has... It has been so rewarding as a family, you know, because we get to see God move in so many places other than just home, you know, instead of just in our church, you know, or in our surrounding community, you know, he's working in every state, you know, he's working in so many people's lives, you know. And it, it just reminds us that he is so much in control. And he guides his children. And it's it's great to see. Um, what I do during the day while Sammy's working, I homeschool Eli. Um, he uses the Becca program, which is a Christian um, homeschooling program. And it is wonderful um i cannot express how, how how good it is i love the program um so eli homeschools and i argue with jace pretty much all day um he is very much my child <laughs> um he's very hard-headed very headstrong um and we argue but you know that's the cross I have to bear with him. Hopefully, um, that will change. But, um, you know, we get, we get to do something, you know, that, that most people, you know, kind of shy away from, that most people are scared to do. Um, you know, and, it's, and this journey is not for everybody. You know, God didn't put this this path in front of everybody he put it in front of us um so i hope you you know just continue your walk with god and continue to to talk to him you know and he will he will lay a path in front of you um and be i pray that you are strong enough to go ahead and make that leap